Okay, so starting with a completely new project here. Uh, all I have right on now is the the microphone. Um, so I'm going to insert a track. Simple Jupiter 8, like I always use. My uh, Arturia Mini Lab is plugged in. So you can hear the audio there. Okay. Next. Insert reactor. Uh, just for clarity. That works. So I know which one. There we go. Reactor. Insert an effect. How about Echomania? Switch this to... Oh. How about Noisy Can? Not really sure where it was getting that audio. Okay. I guess Noisy Can just has, uh, well, call itself oscill oscillation. Okay, so leave this up. Go ahead. Route the Jupiter Edge. Gonna set it to pre-fader. Play. Now I set that to pre-fader. So I could turn that down. So... You can definitely hear the Jupiter being affected, I think. Uh, try a different setting. Yeah. So the Jupiter 8 is definitely being, um, wow, that's loud. Definitely be affected by reactor. However, Turn this all the way down. Look at that. You can still hear the Jupiter 8. Turn reactor off. You can still hear the Jupiter 8. Turn down input. Turn down output. Turn that up just to show it's not affecting. You can still hear the Jupiter 8. Why? This only affects the input to the plugin. So, with this, everything turned down, go ahead and turn master send off, just to make sure, right? But no, can still hear it. So let's go ahead and uh, just record some crap. Oh wait, wrong way. Wanted to record audio. To do that, gotta turn that back up. Record out, okay.
That's enough. Go ahead and trim that. Set it to loop for the hell of it. Play. I can turn those off now, too. Demonstrate that those have nothing to do with it. Again, master send is off. It's being sent to reactor pre-fader. And... Notice the volumes are completely down here still. Turn that back up. Turn that back up. Now I'm getting reactor, obviously. Okay, great. Move that down there. Maybe that's the problem, right? So mute this. Nope. That wasn't the problem. Audio is still just passing right by reactor. Boy, this is irritating. My speech is a little slow here because I had to switch to Wasapi um, so that Open Broadcast could record it, and I'm getting some serious latency. Uh, so that's a little weird to deal with. That's why I um, might sound a little weird talking. Anyhow, moving on. Now, check this out. Put that back up there. Go back to that. Hit play. Hit solo. Notice that it's still coming through here, too. I mean, if I turn this back up. Even though I have this soloed. Even though I have this track soloed, it's still coming out of reactor. I have to mute react oh wait what oh right the master send there we go that was all i was hearing there see how crazy that is i had this track soloed and i was still only hearing it coming out of that track that's messed up solo it it's still coming out here why apparently i have to go Solo ignore routing. Huh, I thought that worked before. Oh wait. Solo ignore routing. That just turned solo off. Solo ignore routing. Okay, fine, that does it. Let's see what happens here. Post fader. Yeah, as you can see, it's still, this is soloed, and it's still passing through a reactor. I have to choose, well, unsolo, and then choose ignore routing. Like, I don't recall ever having had to do that before. I have looked through my settings and I can find nothing that I have changed. I, I have no idea what's going on here. And this is so irritating. Especially the, the part where... The audio is just passing. Solo. Especially the part where the audio is just passing straight through reactor, getting processed, 
and passing through the unprocessed audio. Even if it's, I mean, I've got it routed. Where's the routing matrix? Routing matrix. I don't see anything wrong here. Input one record arm, that's my mic. Hey, kitty, no. Even set this to input none. Still. And what is going on here? Audio one to two, audio one to two. If I set this to three and four, then yeah. It doesn't go through that track anymore. Oh, great. But it also does, I mean, it doesn't go through it at all. So, what is going on here? Please, help. 